So here we are down at the uh, Tilt Attachment Challenge, and I'm with Ian and Pierce here from uh, Mount Lucas, who are judges. And uh, Ian actually was the guy responsible. This was his brainchild coming up with this. Ian, uh, very first of all, talk me through what do we have to do here? Basically, the the attachment here, this one here. So that will go around. It's you grab it with the tilt rotator, okay, down at the end, and you have to fork it through right up around the whole lot without touching it basically so if you touch it it lets off the horn and it lets off the flashing light as well okay and then when they do that then they have to go across to the next challenge which is what come on uh, pick the shapes uh, just pick the shapes basically so they have their table made up here so they pick the shapes here so they have to twist and turn the tilt rotator to make sure the shapes fit into the slots it's basically that's basically it then. And did you get this idea from watching Bosco as a kid, that's putting the things in? Yeah, that's true too. That, someone might pop up over jet. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> a hole in a, what's it called? A hole in a mole or a mole in a hole. Uh, and then they had to get the, they, they use that with the, with the claws, don't they? They, yeah. to, they, they pick up the, squ the, the, the different shapes. So basically the claws is used for the, the buzzer challenge. That's what you call the buzzer challenge over there. And then the different shapes, then the claw picks up the shapes, twists, turns them, whatever way to get them into the, back into their slots where they belong. And then the last bit they have to do is come across here? Yeah, so the, that's the fork challenge. Okay, so the tilt rotator picks up the forks, picks one uh, crate at a time, and puts it in the marked out uh, designated area. So um, basically to move the forks, they're harder slot in when they're squared up and everything like that. So. Okay, there's a bit of a, a sadist side to you because you're, the guys were really nervous doing this and you're, you're kind of mean the way that you've invented it because it's really, really difficult, really, really tough. Pierce, you're judging here. Uh, we've had a few operators up already. Uh, what's the response been like when they see this challenge? Um, it's daunting first with them. Uh, it's something outside of their normal comfort zone. So they're twisting and moving, their judgment, their skill, their uh, tedious controls on this is, is paramount. Of course, an element of fun. Um, no, it's, it's fun to have to... Relax from the working setting, but enjoy it also. You know, work the machine. You should be comfortable enough in it to enter this sector or this uh, type of machine. So let's see what they're made of. This is what it's all about. I'm just kind of getting the idea because it's so difficult. I think the guy who wins this undoubtedly will be a really, really good tilt operator. Without doubt. Um, this is the trickiest one. You know, you're you're navigating your movements. You know, you're so you're you're working a lot of hydraulics, a lot of control. So you're working the, the machine to its maximum efficiency. So these guys are up, they're sitting on the seat for a reason. Let's see who wins. Great, it's very exciting. We'll talk to you guys later on.